I gonna use the microphone. Audio, okay. The microphone. Hello. <laughs> 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 Notification no uche me nche no kem. Hi, we are back again, guys. Hold on, let me share to my page so that some people will come and join us. Just give me a few more minutes. You can entertain them now. You'll be looking at me. Hello. <laughs> You're looking at me. Hold on. So share to a page. Yeah, I got it. Why? 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 Okay, I've shared it. Okay. <coughs> this is the owner of the page, so... Yeah. Hi, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Almost the voice. Is that Philippines accent? Go back to the country. No, don't read comments. We just have to focus. Be looking at the lens. Don't read comments. Because if you read comments, you will see some people that came from the pit of hell. And you will not know what to say. So leave them for me. I know how to handle them, okay? Okay. All right, just... So, can you hear me? <laughs> <laughs> so, this day, my sister's voice is born. Okay. Surprised me. Okay, go and eat your gang coke. My sister is going to do this talking because of my voice. Okay? Oh my, I don't drink ginger. There's no. You have to drink more ginger, don't worry. Okay, good afternoon, everyone. Um, my sister's voice is still um, a mess a little bit, but hopefully, by the grace of God, it's gonna be fine. <coughs> so, um, we have a good news to share with you all. My sister page is now monetized so we're going to be doing more of live stream on her page so that we can be earning money from there as well you all know philippines is monetized for facebook um is eligible for facebook monetization right okay. yeah so good thing is that she got monetized before she came back to nigeria so for now we'll be making more of live streams on her page so kindly Follow my sister because you'll be seeing more of me here. Content. And we'll have a lot of amazing content for you. And please kindly share us out. Okay? So today we're going to be talking about how we cancelled our trip to Istanbul. Yes. Okay. I'm not the owner of the page, but I'm going to be doing the talking. Mm -hmm. Okay? For those of you that are saying you like to talk too much. Please, oh. Mm -hmm. Eh? If you don't like, you can... Also. Yeah, so, so I'll be assisting my sister because of her voice. So, a lot of you have been asking me, Go back to your husband, you've <laughs> overstayed your welcome. <sighs> you are divorced. <laughs> <laughs> well, Chizo, do you know that somebody emailed me? Mm -hmm. God, you see this terrifying message. What did and the person was, say? And I was like, Oh, yeah, no, she didn't even know. What did the person say? How will your sister bring majesty to, the, to Nigeria mm. and leave her husband? Mm. What if her husband find another woman mm. in, in, in Kuwait? Yeah. How, won't she cry? Won't she <laughs> Your sister is not smart. <laughs> okay. Um, the truth was that I was supposed to be in Kuwait right now. <clears throat> but you all remember that... Um, I came to I came to Nigeria from Bosnia, right? Right. So, Darko, hmm? so Darko um, took my Kuwait visa and Majesty visa along with him. No, 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 no. My Kuwait visa was still in in Kuwait. It's called civil ID. Every year we need to. Um, renew it right so mine 
was renewed before we went to Bosnia for vacation. But we couldn't wait to get the civil ID. So because um, we wanted to go on vacation, we were like, okay, somebody will get, get it for us or whatever. Yeah. So we left and left my ID. But Majesty's own was with Darko. So we came to Bosnia. We stayed a few months in Bosnia. And then I came to Nigeria. Right? Mm -hmm. And after my husband was done with his business in Bosnia, mm -hmm. he went back to Kuwait. Right? So he's working. He was supposed to be in Nigeria, but um, you know, he just get back to Kuwait. He cannot just leave Kuwait and start coming to Nigeria again, right? He's gonna have problem with the company, mm -hmm. right? So, luckily enough, my visa was ready. It was out of machine. But how do I get my visa? So, Darko has a Kuwaiti friend who is a pilot. I don't know, did you remember that video? that I was dancing in a desert with uh, my husband and an Arab guy. Yes, I remember. Yeah. That guy we were dancing with is my husband's friend. And he's a pilot, okay? He flies around. So he was supposed to come to, he was supposed to fly to Istanbul, right? So my husband was like, let him use that opportunity and get... Sorry for Our elder brother is calling, so Amaka will message him. So, like I was saying, um, my husband told the pilot, his pilot friend, to help bring my um, visa and Majesty's visa to Istanbul, so that we will meet there and collect it, right? So, my husband forgot that. Me and my sister are still Nigerian passport holders. Mm? No, he did not remember that we are Nigerian passport holders because his um, passport can go to um, uh, Turkey without visa. Majesty has Serbian passport. He can go to Turkey without visa, but I need visa. She needs visa. Yeah. So the, the pilot of a friend accepted to bring my visa to Istanbul, right? So now, Darko has already booked ticket, flight ticket for me and Majesty from Nigeria to Istanbul and then Istanbul to Kuwait. And Darko has already, because he wanted me and my sister to meet at Istanbul, right? Mm -hmm. Before I come to Kuwait, because it's difficult for Amaka to come to Kuwait because of this virus. Kuwait don't issue um, tourist visa. So it's better we meet in Istanbul, right? So Darko booked my sister's um, ticket, flight ticket from philippines to singapore and singapore to istanbul right and then from istanbul to nigeria and darko made a very beautiful hotel reservation damn <laughs> you know darko has a taste uh -huh. he made this very beautiful hotel reservation that i wanted to use it and do pepe you <laughs> I, I have already think about what to do in those hotel guys <laughs> Oh my goodness, we're supposed to spend three days at Istanbul. Yes. And then, after booking this hotel, Darko said, don't worry, when you apply for visa, they're gonna, visa, they're gonna give you visa in 24 hours. So guys, <laughs> after everything, my husband gave us a um, Turkish site to go and apply for um, e-visa. E -visa, yeah. <laughs> it's crazy. <laughs> oh my goodness so while applying they say you must have a supporting document either schengen visa uk visa us visa or I ireland visa guys i don't have schengen visa i don't have uk or us or ireland visa neither do amaka we have uar passport <laughs> they didn't even include kuwait um visa there Maybe if they had included it, maybe only me would have gone. Because why? We've already booked hotel. Guys. Oh my goodness. I cried. Yo. I cried. Oh my goodness. Because I don't want to experience it. So, you know what my sister and I did? Since Philippines, 
was still seven hours ahead of Nigeria, I told my sister to go to Turkish embassy in the Philippines and see if we can apply directly to the embassy instead of online, right? <laughs> when Amaka got to the um, Turkey embassy, they didn't even let her go. <laughs> They didn't even let her go inside. <laughs> they said, no, 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 everything is online. Everything you have to do is online. Since the um, virus, we don't allow face-to-face -face meeting. So you have to go online. So Amaka was trying to tell him that we don't have Schengen visa, this and that, blah, blah, blah. The man now gave her a site. Did they reply you in that site? <laughs> so you notice I was in Kaduna, right? You notice I was in Kaduna, right? Okay. My stay in, in Kaduna was because it's closer to Abuja. So I was waiting for good news from Amaka if they allowed her to go inside and got the visa. Yeah. I was waiting for my own time so that I can travel to Abuja. But it didn't work. Guys, I was disappointed, honestly. My journey to improve. Oh. I was disappointed. I don't know that you need Schengen visa to um, apply for Turkish visa. And if I had known the requirements earlier on, I would have applied for maybe um, Schengen visa or UK visa or US visa, you know, so that I can go to Istanbul. But anyway, now I know there's no harm. So, guys, two days to departure. We notice that we cannot make it. We've already failed. You know, there are some things you have to accept, even though it's difficult to accept. We just have to cancel our flight. I canceled my flight. They, they gave us charges. Amaka canceled her own. They gave us charges. And we canceled the hotel. They took the money. They didn't even return a dime. And I was thinking, who do I know in Istanbul so that my husband can change the person's name to go and enjoy? The person did not even get back to us. So <laughs> that was just it. So I asked my husband to send my um, um, visa through DHL or RMX or whatever to Nigeria. But there is a Kuwait law that said you cannot send civil ID through DHL or RMX. It's like human trafficking or whatever. I don't know. My husband likes going with protocol. He doesn't like doing things like this. He must go to it directly. I don't know what kind of man I'm at. <laughs> so anyway, guys, um, I don't know. That is why I'm still here in Nigeria because I don't have my Kuwait visa. So it's either Darko has to bring it or we find someone that is coming to Nigeria to bring it. That is just it. So, for those of you that are saying I divorced my husband, my husband has left Let me for another no woman, game. you don't know what is happening behind closed doors. I just want to let you know right now because it has already happened. Our flight has been cancelled. And you know I don't like telling people when I want to depart. Yeah. So, I wanted to surprise you, but it didn't work. So, for those of you that are wishing me evil and divorced in my marriage, back to sender. Okay? So, that is just it. Yeah. Come to Canada. Don't worry, I'll come to Canada now, guys. I will come. Any country I want to go to, I will check about their requirement and start applying on time so that this will not happen again. Because right now, I don't have Serbian passport. I'm still working on my residency, but I don't have Serbian passport. So this Nigerian passport of a thing is really affecting us from achieving so many things that other people are achieving. Imagine you have other nationalities passport, you go to the embassy, sharp sharp, you get visa. But in Nigeria, they will ask What's you to that? bring this, okay? bring that, bring your late grandfather father's um, email address. You know, so many requirements that, my goodness. But it's well. It's well. Thank God my sister came back. Yes. Because I was, I was scared for my husband. Like, he has already made a lot of expenses by the charges they collected from cancellation of tickets her tickets majesty's tickets even when he was booking the second flight as cambria we thought it was calm it's calm now it's calm yeah. he didn't get the money back he didn't went to cancel his yeah he, it was not scam they let her refund the money okay because when he when darko was booking the second flight for him for her 
we thought he got scammed right and he has to go to kuwait um his bank in kuwait and cancel his um card and block his card blah 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 but later on the fly um um the company messaged him and told him that the um, payment did not go this that blah 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 and they refunded the money so with that money refundation he booked her ticket so guys if you are praying for me also pray for my husband because not all men can do this yes. there are men that will be like even after the stress <coughs> of not going to Istanbul, even after the money they got from him. He still had the heart to book another ticket from her. And you should know how much tickets cost right now. And it was not ahead of time he booked it. It was just now, now kind of ticket, guys. And he still did it. Amanda, eh? are you finished studying? Are you finished studying or are you going back to Philippines? No, we don't go now. I just she's done, no, guys. She's back home. She's done with her studies. Please, oh, you probably should not ask her when is she going back. She's done with studies in the Philippines and she's back home. When you go abroad to study, come home. And hey, if there's no job in that country, you better come home. So that is just the thing, guys. Thank you. Yes, it's been a long year. And um, I'm not doing graduation. I'll be doing my graduation no, online. Amaka couldn't wait for her graduation. Well, she collected all her documents. So they, they were supposed to do virtual graduation. Yeah, yeah virtual graduation. No need. Let me just come back here. Mm. Don't explain to nobody mm. not glory. We love you. God is real. Focus on the presence. Mm. Yeah. yeah, I'm not explaining to anyone, but this is me explaining what has happened in the past. You know, people were so nosy about my marriage. I don't even care. I let them know what they want to know. If they believe my husband has left me, so be it. But the thing is that stop wishing people evil in their marriage. What is happening to your marriage must not happen to another person. If you are going through another marriage, go and see them in someone. If you are going different um, difficulties in your marriage, don't wish people evil too. All marriages are not the same. Okay? If you are praying for me, pray for my husband. The man has been a very, very supportive man. He don't just love me. He love my family as well. There are men that will that don't like seeing their families, um, men, why 